Little Fox. The real Mother's Day. When do people in the United States make the most telephone calls? On what day do most people in the United States go out to eat? The answer is Mother's Day, the second Sunday in May. On this day, sons and daughters thank their mothers for all their hard work and care. Anna Jarvis is the woman who started Mother's Day in 1914. Why? What was the real Mother's Day supposed to be about? In the 1800s, the United States was fighting a civil war. Injured soldiers and many other people needed care. In 1858, a woman from Pennsylvania named Ann Jarvis wanted to help. Ann Jarvis was the mother of Anna Jarvis. She organized women to provide medical care for soldiers and people affected by the war. The women volunteered in groups called Mother's Day Work Clubs. The clubs were neutral. They helped soldiers and their families on both sides of the war. Ann Jarvis and the Mother's Day Work Clubs. Helped thousands of people to eat, live, and work safely. Near the end of the war, Anne held a Mother's Friendship Day to bring everybody together in peace. Soldiers who had fought each other sat next to each other as friends. This day was so successful that it was repeated for many years after. All her life, during wartime and peacetime, Anne Jarvis helped other people. After she died in 1905, her daughter Anna wanted her mother's good work to be remembered. In 1908, Anna Jarvis held a church service to remember her mother. At the church, Anna handed people white carnations. These white carnations symbolized love and strength, qualities which her mother had possessed. Anna liked the church service very much. She decided to create a holiday to remember mothers everywhere. So she promoted the idea to the government. Finally, in 1914, President Wilson made Mother's Day a holiday. Soon after, Mother's Day became very commercial. Selling things on Mother's Day became more important than its meaning. Florists and stores encouraged people to buy a card, a carnation, or a gift for Mother's Day. People forgot that they could just spend time with their mothers. Anna Jarvis disliked this. She asked florists to stop selling flowers for Mother's Day, but they refused. Anna Jarvis spent many years reminding people of the true meaning of Mother's Day. This Mother's Day, why don't you think about the real meaning of Mother's Day? Do something special for your mother instead of simply buying a gift. You could do extra chores, go for a walk with her, or play her favorite music. That's what the real Mother's Day is about.